Uh-oh. What? We're gonna have to be careful. There's Thalmor in here. Oh, no. This one is not quite sure how they managed to get in here, but they must have been... ...sneaking around and come through another way. Uh-oh. Got company! Oh, no! Okay. Oh, you might want to move. I don't know where they went. Oh, believe me, I can hear them. Oh, jeez. Be careful of their sword, please. Uh, it doesn't matter if you only live. You know. Anyway. You could have come up with something better than that to say, you know? Hi! <laughs> I tried. Ooh, that is a very fascinating shield that you have there. Thank you. It's, uh... It belonged to an old friend, I think. Oh? Uh, don't worry about it. Okay, let us be going and stealthily. Before more of them show up. Hold on. We are going to loot the bodies, no? Normally I wouldn't, but... Would you like a thumb or bow? Ugh, no. No, I would very much not. I kind of get the sense that you have a history with them. Miss... Uh, what was your name again? Kinoa. Almerzim. Ismir. Right? You're the Dragonborn? Uh-huh. Miss Ismir, all Khajiit have, um, history with this Almor, so that is pretty inane. But that's okay. Okay. <laughs> so what precisely brings somebody like you down to the Ratway? Well, it will not exactly fit in. I... I'm looking for an old guy. Who knows a thing or two about dragons. I'm sure you overheard that. Mm, I did. I was kind of hoping to get something else out of you, considering that, uh... You know... We are not around massive amounts of company. True. I have a question for you. Mm-hmm. How did you meet Ingrath? You know his name? Yeah. Cayman. Sorry. Oh, don't worry, I know his name too, I just... You two are much closer than I thought you were. <laughs> I wouldn't say that. He seems pretty... I'm... I'm not sure of a good word. He's a bit of a curmudgeon, it's true. He does not rust easily, and neither do I. I am his... I would say protege, I suppose. That makes sense. He's not like... your dad or something, is he? Oh no. I never knew my father. Neither did he. What? Never mind. You are a very strange woman, Miss Almerzim. Almerzim. Ugh. Your name is very hard for me to say. I notice you're not using that third person that I hear Kaji using mostly. Oh, yes, this is because I am. Well, I suppose I think I'm friends with you, right? I mean, I did save your life twice. This is true. And this is why we are friends, no? I suppose. So... I am not using the third person because we are family. Kind of. Well, it seems like you and Ingrath might be, uh, you know, close, so... I see no point in... the formality. Especially since we are wandering around the rat way. Warrens. That makes sense. 
You still didn't answer my question. You managed to talk your way entirely around it. Oh. <laughs> yes, this one is very good at it. And there you go, using the third person again. Well, you reminded me. Are you gonna take these? Hmm, maybe. Wow. Uh, no. Uh oh. Hey. Did it. I. Hmm. I will take those. I will have some boots that actually match the rest of me now. Hmm, looks spiffy. I will, if nothing else, tell Brinio that all of this is down here, and hopefully he will send me down to collect it. Um... After all this is done. You still didn't answer my question. Oh, would you leave it alone, please? Uh, it is not a very, uh... It is not a very happy tale, and it involves detail more, so, you know... Oh. Mm-hmm. This one would prefer not talking about it. I would very much like to know how you met him, though. Well, coincidence mostly. Give me a minute. I don't think there's anyone down here, is there? Not so far. Coincidence. I was looking around in Falder's tooth and cleared it out, and he came running in wounded, and I just. Well. Did what I usually do and decided to patch him up. Oh, so the same way as you met me. Pretty much. Yeah, although he didn't have Inigo with him, obviously. Well, of course, Inigo was with me. But he had you instead. You're a very nice person. Thanks. You know he is... Uh, uh, he is a vampire, I know. Well, that puts you one step ahead of me. Oh? Well, I didn't know until I woke up in that place with the... you know... Ah. I see. But you're okay with him? Yeah. Yeah, I am. And I suppose that makes me kind of a strange person, doesn't it? I'm okay with him too, so... Not as strange as you might think. Oh, great. Hold on. There. Ink pot, stone, bucket, book, knife. What? Huh? That was... That wasn't you. Knife. No, of course yes. it wasn't. Book. Yes. Bucket? Yes. Ink pot? No. I think we should probably be quiet. This one thinks so as well. Bucket. Knife. Book. Ink pot. Stone. No. No. Oh, I should probably point out, uh, Kevin and I are not as close as you think we are. Oh. Hmm, well, this one could have pulled me. No, never find me. Uh, okay. <laughs> come here, come here, come here, come here! Um. I have a present You're interesting. A nice, shiny present. This one thinks we should put him out of his misery. Yeah, me too. I have a present for you. A nice. I'm gonna eat well tonight, my darling. Don't you ever call me your darling. I'll do. Ink pot. That stone was creepy. Book. Mm -hmm. Knife. Supposedly, there's an old guy down here somewhere. I'm gonna guess it's behind this quadruple locked door right here. That would nice. be my good. No, yes. yeah, my guess. Go away. Nord. Seventies, no. probably. 
Asburn? Don't worry, I'm a friend. And so is she. What? No, that's not me. I'm not Asburn. I don't know what you're talking about. That doesn't sound suspicious at all. It's okay. Delphine sent me. Delphine? How do you... So you finally found her. And she led you to me. And here I am, caught like a rat in a trap. Uh, no. That's not at all what's going on here. I think he thinks we are Thalmor because I am with you? Why would he think that? Because Khajiit have history with the Thalmor, that's why. Oh. Delphine said to remember the 30th of Frostfall. She said you'd know what that means. Ah, indeed. Indeed. Uh, I do remember. Delphine really is alive, then? Yeah. You'd better come in, then, and tell me how you found me, <laughs> and what you no. want. Never okay. Th this'll just take a moment. Oh, boy. This one always sticks. There we go. Only a couple <laughs> more. Knife. Yes. Yeesh. Book. I should get myself yes. a door like that. Bucket. Yes. Ink pot. Do you have a house? There we are. Come in, come in. Make yourself at home. That's better. Now we can talk. Uh... So, Delphine okay. keeps up the fight after all these years. I thought she'd have realized it's hopeless by now. I tried to tell her years ago. What do you mean by it's hopeless? Haven't you figured it out yet? What more needs to happen before you all wake up and see what's going on? Alduin has returned, just like the prophecy said. The dragon from the dawn of time, who devours the souls of the dead. No one can escape his hunger, here or in the afterlife. Alduin will devour all things, and the world will end. Nothing can stop him. Ah, I tried to tell them. They wouldn't listen. Fools. It's all come true. All I could do was watch our doom approach. Alduin? The dragon who's raising the others. Yes, yes. You see, you know, but you refuse to understand. Are you talking about the literal end of the world right now? Oh yes, it's all been foretold. The end has begun. Aldrin has returned. Only a dragonborn can stop him. But no dragonborn has been known for centuries. It seems that the gods have grown tired of us. They've left us to our fate as the plaything of Aldwin the World Eater. I think... I think the gods have a different idea. They haven't abandoned you, Esbern. I'm dragonborn. What? You are... Can it really be true? Dragonborn? Then... Then there is hope. The gods have not abandoned us. We must... We must... We must go. Quickly now. Take me to Delphine. We have much to discuss. Okay. Give me just a moment. I must gather a few things. I'll need... Uh, no. no. Okay. Sorry, I figured I'd give you two a bit of a moment. It seemed like it was important. Yeah. I, uh... One moment. I know time is of the essence, but mustn't leave secrets for the Thalmor. You can keep watch. Mm hmm Doing my best. Um, as he does good ears. Well, I guess that's good enough. Let's be off. Yeah. Give me a second. That'll do. Okay. You might want to hurry, I hear somebody coming. Okay. You stay behind my shield, okay? Uh, neither of you get in front of me. Because... You know... I am Dragonborn. I do have the voice, and I tend to use it. Oh. There's the blaze agent. Who's? Well, crap. Move so I can shoot him! Esper, cannot be 
Ooh, okay. Oh no. Oh, I thought you were. Oh, this is nice. Don't. Okay. I was gonna say thank you, but. Oh, okay. Just kill him. It is fine. Okay. So has Burns a Mage. That's. Well, okay. Mm hmm. Mages are good. Mages are very, very good. Who's there? Indeed. No more. I healed. I healed. It's okay. Wire. Uh oh. What? Did you just. Oh, it doesn't matter. Okay. Huh? Oh boy. Who's there? That would be eight down more. Okay. Just let him come to us. I was never mind. He did. You're welcome. Thank you. You are not exactly the most present of people, are you? No, I'm really not. Probably should have warned you about that. Hmm, doesn't bother me. I will come back for the shinies. <laughs> oh, you know, I'm very glad I'm not doing this alone. Because the last time I didn't have Inigo with me, I, uh, got stuck. Yeah, I'll make sure that doesn't happen. To either of you. Oh boy. I cannot find my way out. I'm likely gonna get lost down here. No, you won't. Just keep going straight. If you ever get lost, just keep your right hand on the wall and follow it. It is a trick! Hopefully there's no more of them. Hey, Zaytess. Mm-hmm? You wouldn't happen to run across a man named Etienne, would you? Uh, no. Not that I am aware of. Never mind. I must have beat him here. Oh, -ho. what's with the weapon? Looks like it's about to get rough in here. Sorry. She didn't mean yes. it, Michael. It's fine. Okay. I'm going to stay here. You take him and go, okay? I have some business here. Oh boy. Yeah, don't worry. That's just Delvin. Okay. You take care of yourself, alright? He's one meal. You take care of yourself and him. I will. Thanks for the help. You are most welcome. Alright, come on, Asburn. It's gonna be a long road to Riverwood. Okay, well that was certainly interesting. Now I'm going to avoid her. So, what do you think, my dear? Could a beautiful woman like go out this way. see yourself with an old codger like me? Absolutely. Oh. After all, I really don't want to go... snooping around anywhere associated with Mercer Frey without Inigo. Hello! How are you? I'm relieved for an open mind, or that could have gotten bloody. Yeah. It seems everybody is still a little bit on edge in here. I cannot say as I blame them. 
Vale. This one should probably change back out of her seed skill armor, no? We'll need to be causing a stir around town and all that. No. I dare Mercer to come back here. He sets one foot in the cistern and I'll cut it off. Ooh, this one likes the way you think. E. <laughs> Let us see. There we go. A little bit better. Okay. This one really needs to do something about, you know, her public persona. Considering that uh, being a known thief is not exactly a very good thing for a thief, no? Okay, that must be Rally. Thank you. Uh, steering around that. And Brignal has given this one free reign to... Uh, Do what she needs to do, eh? This is why we are taking Inigo with us. Excuse me. Need something? Nope. Well, yes, but this one. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Her friend. There seat. he is. Azura's wisdom to you, friend. Uh huh. And right back at you. Inigo? Yes, my friend. Let's go. We have a job. Come on, legs. We are on the move again. Good to see you again. Oh. Well, I mean, if that is how you want to warm up, that's fine with me. It's a little bit unorthodox, but that's okay. Come on. Need something? Nope. We shall just take a stroll around the market. No. Nope. This one wanted to say, she actually just had a run-in with the Dragonborn, you remember her, right? Yes, I can see it on your face, you do. So this one has now repaid her debt, and all should be well. Okay. Everybody is doing things. This one is very interested in his exotic ingredients, but... Also doubts that they are as exotic as he actually to tell about it. claims. And fine here. This one could have sworn she heard the dragon, and that is bad. Hello. Nope. Right on the other side of this. <laughs> now this could be interesting. Because we have to get in there, into the, uh, the Blackbriar Manor? No, Mercer's house. The Blackbriar Manor, is that one, I think? Oh, I do not know. Either way, we have some, uh, stabby business to do. This one thinks. Ooh. Let us see. There should be a mechanism to shoot in there somewhere. I cannot see Val from here. That is badness. Oh well. Are you hearing that, Inigo? Or is it just me? <coughs> yes, I know we have business to attend to, but... Ooh, I could have sworn I heard the dragon. Again. You know what? I'm going to take some of these nightshade. Some one of these days, yours truly is going to settle down and become <coughs> an alchemist. I can tell you don't believe me. Are you okay? Uh huh. Okay, just checking. If you need anything else, just ask. Yes. Well, what I need. Hmm. Away. Let's see. The 
This may be the stupid way. We shall see. Thank you. No. Can't really get a clear shot from here. I can hear him now. the lock. There's the lock. E. Oh no. How are we going to get in there? Oh, nice. This one will try to find a way to hop the fence, but I don't think there is one. Maybe. Ugh. Nope. It does not go all the way around, unfortunately. This one wonders if she could perhaps get Valve's attention. And then do some sneaky business. No? This is Mercer Frey's place, and he don't like visitors. Now go away. Ah, uh, Kajit would like to get inside there, please? No visitors. No way. Now piss off before you make me mad. <sighs> this one is becoming angry. You do not want to make Kajit angry. You would not like her when she's angry. And uh, nor would you like her big blue fla blue, big blue friend over there. <laughs> That's funny. You think you can take me on? Try it any time. I've been itching for a fight. Hmm. Yes, this one kind of thought that wouldn't work. Not with the way she stumbled. But Mercer needs you and Margaret right away. You might want to get going. Oh, come on. I ain't that dumb. I mean, it was worth a shot, no? How about if Kajit makes it worth your while? You ain't got enough coin to make my problems go away. Unless you can talk Maven Blackbriar into letting me out of my debt. You try and set one foot in this yard and I'll cut it off. Hmm. Okay. Until next time. <laughs> Here you go. Guess what I did. Swear she hears the dragon. Sheet. Kajit has very nimble fingers. <laughs> now then. Oh yes. Uh in you go. Trouble. Oh. In you go. I know I heard something. Now with the curse to the test. 
we probably could have just snuck in. But that was fun. He kind of deserved it. So, you know. Oh, Inigo, it smells like Mercer in here. <laughs> Two threes? What was she thinking? Fool never saw me pull that ace out of my boot. Kill him. He talks to me. We are not alone. While he's sleeping. Poison is me. See how he likes that. Oh, no. Now ain't this a surprise? Whoop. Here you go. Oh, there he is. Can't hide from me. Here you go. Company. There you are. I'll mount your head on my wall. I think this is what we were born to do. Depressing. Oh. You think we were born to kill bandits? Oh. Yes, I know that was only dead body. I have eaten worse. It is fine. This one does not think this is what we were born to do. Oh, excuse me. This one thinks we were born to make lots and lots of coin and retire as well as the Kajis. I'm not sure. <laughs> or something. Hmm. Hello, Mr. Biala. Do not deserve to be in a place like this. No? That is a lot of salmon. Oh, I didn't really need a plate. I mean, I suppose I could sell it, but uh, I'm really more interested in the salmon. Ooh. And I'm taking your cheese. Uh, let's do one of each. What do you need? I found a sweet roll for you. I am listening. Uh, oops. I... yes. If I have it, you have it. Let us see. Oh. We are both carrying a lot of junk, aren't we? <laughs> oh well. A sweet roll for you. Perhaps two, because I have one. And some cheese. Let us go. A spigot. <gasps> My generosity has been rewarded with more sweet rolls. Cities provides, or something. Or perhaps Azura, Azura does. Blah, 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 blah. But it is garbled today. Oh, hello. Oh, no. Uh. 
I was thinking that one was fake too, but it is not. Oh, hey! Well? Beef. <laughs> Ajit finds it very fun to say beef. Oh, hey, you go. There are traps here. We should be careful. She says, and then steps on traps. Oh. Okay. Ah! okay. was painful. Eek. This one would say perhaps you should stay there. But he seems to be heeding my warning anyway. Ooh. Yes, please. Although I'm not sure what I would do with the stamina potion. Like this one is ever running out of stamina. Oops. Oh, are you kidding me? Okay. Oh, ouch. Okay. <laughs> well, don't cut my tail, but... Tell me there is a pull switch here somewhere. Oh. Nope. Well, hey. Oh, come on. We weren't that close. She has no patience after getting her tail smashed. However, we can make this much easier. We just need to summon Inigo. I feel magical. <laughs> this is good. You, you are magical, Inigo. Uh huh. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, let us get back to it. Well, we're here. Ooh. I found a shiny sword. Ugh, come on. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Oh, look. Who is this? looks, uh, suspicious. You know, that is a very good idea. Also... Speak to me. Um... What was I going to... Right! What is yours is mine. I found a shiny sword. I do not know if you would like it. But... Shiny sword. For you. Just in case. Let us go. Indeed. Let us see. We have. Yeah. I would like to read this, please. Ah. Uh, something about a statue and a big gem thingy, and a big long set of turtles. Many thanks. M. That would be Mercer, I think. I hope. <laughs> Not certain how you managed to get your hands on that item we discussed, but I'm more than pleased. I thought you'd simply wait until it was being transported from Castle Tower. Uh, something 
something about the usual cut from R, which is the last Diagonian maid. Okay. What is this? Ugh. Morning. <gasps> oh, this is a shiny ring. Thank you. This one will take this and put it on. Hee hee hee. This one has quite a, quite a few rings and some other strange and random things. Hmm. Do you wear heavy armor? I don't think so. Maybe I should sell that one. Actually, no. This one knows somebody who wears heavy armor. <laughs> Sorry. Perhaps she should save that ring and remember to give it to Kinoa the next time she sees her. No? Okay. I'm for the key again. Maybe? Oh, danger. Why are we danger? Oh. Hey, Inigo, I was just down here. <laughs> Ooh. Are you okay with... That. I guess I was just hearing things. Yes, this one thinks so. I was just down here with Miss Dragonborn. I guess they were just waiting for... For the Thalmor to clear out. Oof. You're okay with the Thieves' Guild, correct? What do you need? Mind if I ask you something? What is it? Uh, never mind. Let us go. Oh, hey, we don't have to sneak anymore. Uh, I know you have history with some of these people. Like Vex, if I remember correctly? Mm-hmm. Any thoughts? Are you sure it is okay that I am here? I... I hope so. If you need anything else, just ask. Mm-hmm. Oh. Although, perhaps it would be best if you wait in here for a little bit, and I will go deal with business elsewhere. Yes, my friend. And by elsewhere, I mean just kind of in there-ish. I hope I know the answer. You can try to relax here if you can. I'm not sure if anybody would remember you, but perhaps. Okay, I will case the joint and keep my ears open for profitable information. Interesting. This one likes the way you think. What are you looking at? Uh, Inigo, actually. <laughs> Uh oh right, Tonilia. There's no doubt Mercer will make for the borders of Skyrim. I hope you find him before he escapes our grass. Oh, you think so, eh? Uh, perhaps. What do you give me for these? I've got coin and I've got merchandise. Let's see what we can do. Now I picked up. Well, a couple of things. I picked up a whole bunch of random things. The Bella statue? For instance. Ooh, and some of these. Mm. I picked up a dish in there somewhere. A plate. There we go. I 
I think that is it. Thank you. If you find Mercer, give no quarter. Kill him and be done with it. We'll do. <laughs> I see Indigo and... Is that Vex? Nope. Well, that's confusing <laughs> and embarrassing. I thought that was Vex. I was going to say they're catching up on old times, but I was Need something? Very wrong. Okay. Hello. I'm back. How can I help? Uh, Alright at the moment. I'm not sure you can. This one is to find Delvin and figure out who this bust is of. Hello, Brignol. Fine back. We've scoured the town and I've spoken to every contact we have left. No sign of Mercer. Oh, you fell Any busy. luck on your end? Well, he was not a drift wheeled manner, but they test found some plans if they are interesting to you. Shore's beard. He's going after the eyes of the Falmer? That was Gallus's pet project. If he gets his hands on them, you can be certain he'll be gone for good and set up for life. You know, this one sometimes forgets that you're actually in Nord, and then you say things like Shore's beard. Anyway, we must stop you, yes? Agreed. He's taken everything the guild has left, and to go after one of the last greatest heists is just an insult. Mm. I've spoken to Carlia and made amends for how the guilds treated her. Now she wishes to speak with both of us, quickly. We have no time to lose. Okay. Uh, this one would like to talk to Delvin first, though. Until next we meet, lass. Okay. I'll be back. Oh, I'll be back, Carlia. Yes. Do 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 do. Oh. No. This storage cabinet gets left open quite a lot. Come, come, I haven't got all day. Oh, Delvin. So, what could I do for you today? Well, uh, what? Okay. I'll be willing to buy. Satan's found a bust of this dude with the mask. Is it worth anything? Well, well. I was looking for this little beauty. If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, be sure to bring them to me. I promise it'll be worth the effort. Must have come from Mercer's place. He'd admired the Grey Fox for some time. Sure, I'll buy it from you. Here you are. Oh, the Grey Fox. Interesting. And what about the sheep model? This one she found back in... the... the, the somewhere. Well, well. I was looking for this little beauty. If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, be sure to bring them to me. I promise it'll be worth the effort. What a delightful find. This should cover it. Oh, thank you. Okay, now this one has to go speak to Carlia, but yes. Don't back this up. Okay. I will do my best. Because it will keep her eyes out for anything else interesting and shiny. Because she has a very good eye for shiny things. <sighs> okay. She was beset by a yawn. Okay. Kaji has Bring returned. Off. The time has come to decide Mercer's fate. Until a new guildmaster is chosen, the decision falls to you. I lass. And I've come to a decision. Mercer Frey tried to kill both of you. He betrayed the guild, murdered Gallus, and made us question our future. He needs to die. We have to be very careful, Brignol. Mercer is a nightingale, an agent of Nocturnal. What are all true? So Everything I heard in the stories. The Nightingales, you know, their allegiance to Nocturnal, and the Twilight <laughs> Sepulchre. <Sepulchre's. laughs> That's why You're we need to prepare ourselves and meet Mercer on equal footing. Just outside of Riften, beyond the southeast gate is a small path cut up the mountainside. At the end of that path is a clearing and an old standing stone. I'd ask you both to meet me there. Excuse me, Yeah, you need something? Nick? Uh, 
I was gonna ask you to speak up because Khajiit can hear everything in here and cannot filter out the noise, but it was up the path and up the mountains, right? I'm preparing to leave for the standing stone. What is it? Right, the standing stone. Will do. Hey, everybody. Oh. I have some preparations of my own to make. I'll meet you at the stone. Okay, sounds good. Oh, this one does not really want to go on another trip. What? That's okay. <laughs> it's the middle of the night, at least nobody will, nobody will follow us. Hello. Greetings. You know where I am. Do not forget about me, please. I won't. Yes, my friend. How are you doing, Inigo? It has been... quite a road. I apologize for being absent for so long. I am a little gassy today, <laughs> but other than that, all is well. <laughs> How is everything with you? This one... This one is not gassy. Really ever made. <sighs> sure, it tastes great. To be honest, in the go. This one is not doing so well. I am sorry to hear that. What? Do you want to talk about it? Am I responsible if the vintage was off on that case? Well, so, you know the rules, Michael. No refunds. I'm just kind of, you know. I just keep reliving Mercer and I'm not here for it, you know? Are you a little low or drowning in a pool of hopelessness? Well... Neither, really. I'm not sure. Coming so close to death is like... I don't know. I just don't feel like doing anything else except getting to the bottom of this and... I don't know, perhaps running away. You know? It's like... <sighs> Talking to the Dragonborn earlier, it was very, very strange. She was... I don't know. In her presence, it kind of feels like I'm just... You know, pointless. There's so much going on and I can't do anything about it. You only feel despair? Everything else is numb? <sighs> yeah, something like that. A nasty place to be. I do not know about you, but for me that feeling is often made worse by a sense of emotional isolation. You are not alone, my friend. Oh. Thank you, Inigo. I wish I could take your pain away. I know I cannot, but talking about it often helps a little. Oh. Thank you, Inigo. You know, after the other night in Winel, that was... I think I needed to hear that. I have a lot on my mind, but uh, let's talk about something else, no? Of course. Remember, I am always here if you want to talk. Yeah. <laughs> Any thoughts? I'm thinking how happy I am you have given me another chance. I will not waste it. Oh. Let me go, you always make me feel better. And I feel really bad that I have to go and do things on my own again. Are you okay with that? I am a little tired, but other than that, all is well. Well, that's How good. is everything with you? Well, I'm, I'm better now. Thank you. Good. Let us talk of other things. Hmm. Okay. You stay here. I will undoubtedly be back. Put together and have a okay, ship talk to you later. <clears throat> Looking for anything special. <laughs> well, Don't let the... Uh, Don't let Vets get you. Quality. What do you want, Cat? Baby. That stuff's mm. getting tough to bring across the border. I... The Argolian patrols. Well, if it 
turns up, I'll be willing to buy. I could tell he was just panicked the other day when I ran out and started crying, but... I think he just needed some time to think about it. I think I did too. I feel very bad leaving him again. Very, very bad, but... It kind of seemed like... This was not the kind of thing that Carlia wants me to bring friends along for, you know? You know, Inigo kind of reminds me of Kinoa. They both just know things sometimes. Like, I don't know how she knew about my dad. Or about... the uh, Cayman's dad. That is just bizarre. I think those two are probably closer than they admit to. That would be my guess. I hear dragons. That is not good. Hello! With any luck... Miss Kinoa is going to be around somewhere fighting said dragons, no? Now did she say it was just before or just past the windmill? Cannot remember. I suppose the answer would be look for a standing stone and do that. It, well, I would. Except that it is... Okay, I see something over here. It is a stump. But there's also a path here. Um... Maybe? <gasps> Ooh! Hey! Glad you found the place. I'm glad you're here. Hmm. So, uh... What is with this stone? This is the headquarters of the Nightingales. Cut into the mountainside by the first of our kind. We've come to seek the edge we need to defeat Mercer Frey. What kind of an edge, hm? If you'll follow me, I'll try to explain on the way. Okay. Oh boy. This way, please. Well, this is interesting. I'm just as puzzled as you, lass. Well, good to know I'm not alone. Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm very tired, but I'm coming. Big shout out to all of our wonderful patrons, including The Wind, William, and our current Grand Architect, Kay. <laughs> 